All right, so Alexi Olenek just went out there and choked Mark Hunt out in the first round. And he did it in spectacular fashion, and I'll tell you why. Mark Hunt looked good as hell out there. I actually thought Mark Hunt looked good. Mark Hunt clipped Alexi Olenek's ass with an incredibly strong, hard, sharp, incredibly fast right hand. He clipped him with that right hand. Alexi Linick ass was, you know, went around like the damn exorcist. You know, I thought he would have been out. That shot would have laid anybody else out. I think that shot would have laid anybody else out. It was tight. Mark Hunt even was looking like, okay. After that punch, Mark Hunt was like, all right, we. I see what I'm dealing with. I see what I'm dealing with. A tough little bastard. That's what I'm dealing with, you know. So the fight keeps going on. Alexio Linick, he just kind of stayed in there. He stayed right in the space. You know, Mark Hunt was hitting him with those strong leg kicks, hard leg kicks, but Olenek just never gave up. He kept kind of not marching for it necessarily, but he kept having these little small, short blitz attacks. You know, really short blitz attacks that one of them clipped Mark Hunt. One of them clipped him up, man. One of those shots clipped Mark Hunt. One clipped him up, and then the second one took him off balance a little bit, sent him to one knee. After that, I think Alexi Olenek felt pretty confident just taking the guy to the ground and doing what Alexi Olenek does on the ground. They don't call him the boy constrictor for nothing. They don't call him the boy constrictor for shits and giggles, man. The guy literally got on the ground, got his body around him in one way, in another way. He got a hook, and then he flipped him over. Then he choked this guy out. He choked him out, you know? And it didn't even look like he was going to choke him out because it was just kind of looking a little bit lackadaisical, like he was just going to hang around, hang, like he was just going to hang out in the neck area and keep threatening a choke. But at one point that thing stitched in and Mark Hunt's eyes was like, Oh, we in trouble. Tell him to cut. Tell, Hey man, tell the team to call the bus driver. Tell him to start the engine. Cause I think we're going to be out of here soon. And that's exactly what happened, man. Mark Hunt tapped. Mark Hunt tapped. Man, he tapped. He had to tap to that choke. It was in so fast. It was like two seconds. He had to tap. He had to tap out. As far as the whole card, a bit of a letdown. The entire card was a bit of a letdown. This fight, this fight could have been on any card and it would have been great. You know, headlining this card, it definitely, the Russians got their money's worth because everything else was just like, unless it was just because you want to support your nation, then okay, fine. But if you were looking for some type of entertainment, my goodness, my goodness. You know, I fell asleep. I actually fell asleep and... You know, and I kind of, I wasn't really, I was watching and I was into it, but it was just like, at one point I fell asleep on one of the fights. It was that bad. You know, I've got something that I'm about to get ready and, and, you know, take a shower and head out, get ready to do tonight. So the nap was pretty good for me because I'm well energized right now. But for for this fight pass, they got to, I wish that they would stack some of these fight pass cards that are in other countries. Because this one wasn't good. But anyways, this fight was good and this finish was phenomenal. Anyways, guys, leave your thoughts in the comment section. Hit that like button. Hit the subscribe button.